What's poppin' homies? It's your favorite homegirl, Gossip Girl. Happy Monday to you all. So today I want to talk about this shooting that happened yesterday on Mother's Day. It is a tragedy. It is, it's crazy. Um, Seven people are dead, including the sus- suspect, suspected gunman after a shooting at a Colorado Springs, Colorado birthday party. Okay. Authorities responded to a shooting call at a mobile home park early Sunday and found six adults dead and one man seriously injured. The man later died at the hospital. The Colorado Spring Depart- um, Police Department said in a news release, police said children at the trailer park were, were not hurt. And now with relatives. The shooter was the boyfriend of a female victim at a par- at the party attended by friends, family, and children. He walked inside and began shooting before dying by suicide. The neighborhood lined with mobile homes with big yards is usually quiet. Okay. Neighbor Jennifer Ye- uh, Reyes told the paper that uh, she awoke early Sunday to the sound of many gunshots. That is horrible. She said, I thought it was a thunderstorm, she said. Then I started hearing sirens. She said, the police brought children out of the trailer, putting them into at least one patrol car. They were crying hysterically. Freddie Marquez told the Denver Post that he attended the party and all the victims were members of the same extended family who were celebrating the birthdays of Marquez's wife and her brother. He said that his family had left early because his wife had to work early the next morning. His wife woke up around 4 a.m. to get ready for work and saw all her missed calls. She lost her mother and two brothers in the shooting. It's just crazy. It's not what we expected on Mother's Day. (sighs) Tell me about it. He also said that I'm at a loss for words. In an initial report, police said the shooter knew the victims. Police have not released their names and said they were... They are all still investigating a motive. Today we find ourselves mourning the loss of lives and praying solemnly for those who were injured and those who lost family members in a senseless act of violence on Sunday morning. Colorado Springs Mayor John Southern said in a statement, Colorado Governor, Governor Jared Polis said on Twitter that the shooting was devastating, especially as many of of us are spending the day celebrating the women in our lives who have made us the people we are today. So the gunman, we don't know why it happened. We don't know what caused him, you know, why he would do this, but he went in the mobile home park and just started shooting and <clears throat> turned the gun on himself. Mm, mm, mm. Whew, I tell you, boy, it is crazy crazy with these shootings i don't understand i don't understand what's going on it's so much going on and then you know yesterday was mother's day and i'm not saying crime stopped because crime happened non-stop every day all day about a minute okay but so much happened on sunday i was like i refuse to, to break my quiet time to talk about it so I said, let me bring it to you guys on Monday. But this is sad. This is just one of the stories that I wanted to talk to you about. I have at least two others that I want to talk to you about. But this is just sad. Like, this is a birthday party. Okay? Children are there. So this guy didn't care anything about the kids being there. He just saw his target or whatever the case may be and just went full-blown crazy. Um, and then he turned the gun on himself. Coward move. Coward move. You know? Oh, my goodness. I I just don't understand it. I really don't. Mm -mm -mm. So, I don't know what caused this. They said they're still investigating. Um, It's just really crazy. Um, It's just... Because not too long ago, didn't the the Boulder supermarket... um, mass shooting happened it was not too long ago um and i think it was in um let me see 
Boulder, Colorado. Yeah, it was another major shooting. It was another mass shooting in the supermarket. And that wasn't that long ago. That It wasn't that long ago. And I think that was in, well, this is May. I think that happened in March. I think that happened in March. It's a lot of stuff happening. And then um, it says here, Colorado had the sixth highest rate of public mass shootings out of the 50 states in a database compiled in March by U.S. US Today. Mm -mm. In 2015, a man shot three people to death at random before dying in a shootout with the police in Colorado Springs on Halloween. Okay. At a Planned Parenthood clinic, in the city, just a month later, a man killed three people and injured eight others. At a movie theater in Aurora in 2012, a gunman killed 12 and injured 58. I remember that. And then we have Columbine High School. That happened in 1999. Two students killed 12 others and a teacher died before dying by suicide. So this is a mess. This is a mess. And this is a thing that happened, you know, in Colorado. But I remember the Columbine one. Um, I remember the Columbine shooting. I remember the Boulder mass shooting. It's just crazy. Mm -mm -mm. My condolences and prayers go out to the family of those that lost their loved ones. Um, I'm just glad those children didn't get hurt, you know. <sighs> It's just a mess. It is just a mess. Mm -mm -mm. Well, keep those families in prayers, guys. And I'll talk to you later.